Okay, so podcasting versus YouTube. When should you pick podcasting over YouTube if you're a small business? Uh, this is a really good question. And um, to me, it, it seems that it's really more a matter of like a disposition, you know, like some people just don't want to be on video, right? They, they, they really would rather um, interact through audio content. Uh, so that they don't go in front of the camera and you know that's that's up to you to decide um and and if you really don't want to be in front of the camera podcasting is a good route to go uh but there's more than that is that podcasts have really become the the new cool thing because in a sense youtube and all the video platforms have been around for like a long time and they've kind of lost that novelty and that coolness. Um, podcasts, listening to podcasts, that's really the cool thing now. Like, um, I can't even, <laughs> I can't even imagine uh, the, the amount of minutes or hours of podcasts that I've listened to myself personally just this year. <laughs> I think, I think it's crazy. And, and, and I think a part of that is that with YouTube and video platforms, you kind of got to look at the screen. With a podcast, you can just be playing in the background and you can be doing something else. Um, so th there's a lot of engagement. I actually think that uh, there's a shortage of content on podcasts. Um, so so people are consuming like everything. So if you if you really put out your small business content on podcasts, I think you can grow really exponentially. Um, so there are a lot of reasons to actually go for podcasts besides just not wanting to be on video. Like you can get much much higher. Uh, engagement and much much higher uh, listen hours uh, and you can really build uh, a really strong community around uh, your podcast content and uh, if you want to learn how to grow your solopreneur business you can pick up my free solopreneur profits bootcamp the link is in the description